The gruesome new details tonight in the case of the nursing student killed while running on the University of Georgia campus. How the suspect allegedly tried to conceal her death amid major questions now about how, why he was in this country. Steve Osinsami in Georgia again tonight. In arrest records, prosecutors say that this 26-year-old from Venezuela accused of murder on the University of Georgia campus did conceal the death of 22-year-old Lakin Riley by dragging the victim to a secluded area. Riley was a cross-country runner at her old high school in the Atlanta suburbs and was a nursing student at a school near UGA when she was out running near this lake and was killed. Jose Ibarra is in a Georgia jail charged with murder tonight, and his story is adding fuel to the fire over immigration. Mr. Ibarra has been charged with malice murder, felony murder, aggravated battery. It's now a year and a half after authorities first arrested him for crossing the southern U.S. border unlawfully. And in that same time, federal officials say he was also arrested in New York City for a motor vehicle license violation, acting in a manner to injure a child less than 17. He was released each time. He and his brother were living in an apartment building near jogging trails where Riley was killed. Prosecutors say Ibarra prevented her from making a 911 call and used an object to kill her. This was a crime of opportunity uh, where he saw an individual and uh, bad things happen. Unrelated to the murder, the suspect's brother was also arrested for having a fake green card and the university is announcing more than $7 million in security upgrades, including better lighting and more cameras. David. Steve Osinsami on this case in Georgia again tonight. Thank you, Steve. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.